Yo! What is up everybody? Hold on, the shark is back. Get out the spear. Stab that little mother effer. Work him over. He's out of here. Float your corpse to the bottom of the sea where you'll be ate upon by the crabs. By the crab men. Crab men. He's crab bait. Anyways, what is up everybody? This is a Brumanati. A what? And as you may already be able to tell, we are back at Raft. And I am back in the water like a dumbass. So what I'm hoping to accomplish is to get a floor. A second floor in. Alright, let's build us a little bit more here. I don't know how far you can go out with a pillar. Looks like one space from the pillar. It's just a little bit touchy. It's hard to get to on that spin wheel sometimes. Now, hold on. I think you could space those pillars out one more. There should be two spaces in between each pillar, but I've already done it on this first floor, so that's where we're going to stick. But for the second floor, going into the third floor, we'll have to remember that. It's two spaces. Alright, let's uh, throw down some more flooring now that we got our pillars up. Oh, beautiful, beautiful second story. Look at that, just magni magnifico. We need a second row of pillars out here. I wonder how many chests you can actually build. Probably just one. That's a good call to try to build a second one at some point. But it does take a lot of scrap iron, so that's not what I'm going to do now. You need scrap iron for the pillars. I need some. I need to get some trees going though. At some point in my life. All right, we can expand our floor to the end here. I really want to get. A tree going. Why am I building it on the second floor of my house? I don't know. That is a perfectly good question that I can't answer right now. I just I just want to. Perhaps that gets changed. I don't know. But for now, that's where I want to put it. And you got to have your taters by your trees for easy harvesting. You have to get some tater seeds and some palm seeds. Yeah, go ahead and plant that up, tater eel. That's a that's a big tin for good buddy. Bust out my palm seeds. Throw them in there. Boom! We'll have a tree in no time. Actually, I don't know how long it takes. It looks like it's going to go pretty fast. I already seen like the, sh the little shrubs start to grow. So I need to get the shark to stop eating my the wood so I have healthier meat to eat when I kill him. Maybe, maybe we can make some type of treaty. He's got some pretty nasty uh, bioaccumulation going on with eating all this treated wood. Dang, that has grown really quick already. Oh, there he is. Dude, we need to make a deal. Oh, I forgot to I forgot to repair that and now my cooker is gone along with my piece of meat. You dirty bastard! Why would the shark want to do that? Bro, we're, we're both out here trying to live, you know? 
If I have an extra piece of mackerel, I'll throw it to you. Just leave my raft alone. You know, there is a problem that I'm starting to realize about building stuff right on the edge of your boat. I'm, I'm beginning to think you're going to need a cat, uh, like a catwalk around the boat. Or there's nothing on it, it's just basically shark defense. All right, we're gonna need to put up some more pillars. Oh, I've messed up. See, okay, th this pillar plan is just in its infancy. I just wanna get the second story real good and we can always come back by and rearrange the pillars. But for right now, I'm gonna have to take something out here. Can you beat that out? Um, the axe is supposed to be able to beat anything to shit. It doesn't appear like I can get, I'm gonna have to take the... Yeah, that's weird. I'm gonna take the foundation out. <laughs> I'm gonna keep trying though, damn it. You should be able to destroy that with an axe. But I just built the damn thing, so I hate to take it back out already. Wasteful. Wasting my scrap iron. Alright, we can do some more floors. I like the design pattern about the alternator alternating decking from the bottom to the top. Yeah, I'm gonna have to do, do something down there. And I'm gonna have to rethink my uh, my pillars. There's definitely a lot to not, absolutely not be envious about, about my pillar selection. In fact, um, you know what? I'm not going to put you through all the pillar selection. I'm, I'm going to redo this. Uh, I'm going to put decking around the edge of the catwalk. So, well, you know what? I'm just going to sign off to the magic of editing. I will end up with a new and improved raft because my pillar layout is completely ridiculously stupid along with my other um, layouts. So what I'm going to do... I'm going to fix it off camera. We're going to come back and we're going to have this beautiful raft. Here we go. Editing. Boom. And like that, guys, the whole entirety of the raft looks completely different. I know it looks like a whole new raft, but it isn't. I changed the floor plan. I built onto it. I didn't want to put you guys through the redesign. I increased the net space. Switched up the pillars, had to expand it widthwise, and um, I took the trees and I put them on the outside down here. I still need to build um, like a catwalk protective bar barrier on the outside of those pillars because I learned if the shark attacks that and it's on the very outside, the foundation disappears, the pillar disappears, and everything above it that it was supporting disappears. So I need to do this. So if a shark attacks, it won't destroy every level above it. So anyways, I put the tree at the bottom because I expect them to be like one story tall. Well, they're like two stories tall, so it would have screwed up my floors. So I went ahead and moved them downstairs. Now, so far as... Yeah, I put that in the wrong spot, that one. So as far as the second level, I finished the flooring on it. I got all the columns and I just need to finish the flooring. But I just wanted to let you guys in on that. I didn't want to drag you through a redesign. 
that would have increased the video and not have added much to it other than this is what I screwed up. This is what I screwed up. Oh, I screwed up that too. So now I'm feeling pretty good about the design. I think we can build from here on out straight up. I did learn one thing I got. I wanted to tell you guys as I was redesigning. I noticed nothing was flowing into my nets. And I was just like, I needed iron for the pillars. And um, I was only getting wood and thatch from harvesting the trees. I was just like, what the hell is going on? I needed to restart the game. When I restarted the game, boom, my nets were filling back up crazy-like. So if you experience that problem, restart the game. Like, seriously, there was nothing in my nets and there was nothing floating in the water. Boom. We got the foundation for the third floor. Anyways, there was something else I wanted to say before I signed off this video. Um... Oh, there was a, there's this building. Um, I can't remember. It's not Taipei 101. I think it was one in Indonesia, like Kuala Lumpur or something. But it had two really tall buildings with a cool catwalk, like really high in between them, linking them together. That's what I'd like to do here. I think that'd be pretty badass looking. I don't know, because I haven't watched very many videos on this game. I don't know if anybody's ever built up yet to see how high you can go. They probably have, but there's nothing like doing it yourself. As far as the flooring design, I'm going to make like a spiral staircase going up. Instead of making one go this way, and then this way, and then this way, and then this way. It's going to be a cool spiral design. But with that, guys, I'm going to go ahead and sign off. If you're enjoying this content, go ahead and stop the shit I like and subscribe. And I will see you back here for the next upload. Make sure you watch the next raft because I'm planning on going up. There's nothing more we need to do base-wise, any of that. Just going up. Peace. Ruminati out.